What is the best Forza game ever made? Okay, DJ, don't even bring up Forza Street. We pretend that that doesn't exist. I'm seeing a lot of Horizon 3, a lot of FH1, a lot of FH2. All very good suggestions. All of those would be wrong, though. Forza Horizon 1 came out nearly 10 years ago. Does anybody else just get, like, the biggest hit of nostalgia from this? Just saying. Oh, yeah, it was 2012, so there was dubstep. <laughs> this isn't any normal Forza Horizon because for the first time ever, this is Forza Horizon 1 on the PC. People who make the emulators have been working hard to get FH1 to run smoothly. And a couple of weeks ago, they finally did it. This is FH1 in 1440p. You can actually run it at 4K, but you do need a 3090. And at 60 FPS for the first time ever. Because of that, you will notice some very, um, sus thing. Darius Flint will be arriving at Horizon today. So, if you're on the roads just now, then stay out of his way, kids. He does not play well with others. I am so hard right now. Why is my computer not melting? Also, massive shout out to Ank for helping me get all of this set up. Like I was saying, you might notice a couple of problems with this game. For example, I don't have any rear view mirrors. You can sometimes see them ghost in every now and again, but if I jump into the interior view, uh, God damn it, I lost to Darius Flint. He's already racing. Typical Darius. But hey. Ooh, why is this game such a vibe? Holy shit, the wing mirrors actually work on this car. Uh-oh, problem, problem, problem. I'm having another skill issue. Anyways, you will definitely notice a couple of other... We'll call them issues with this game. We will get into those shortly. This game's atmosphere is just un... Match. We are arriving at the Horizon Festival. Thank you very much. My GPU's actually just fine. The CPU's fine. My PC isn't melting. Jesus Christ. Don't, don't chat. Stop. For those of you who don't know, these cutscenes in Forza Horizon 1 were actually cutscene. Nowadays in Forza Horizon 5, everything you see is actually built in the actual engine of the game. So like when a character walks up to another character, that's actually happening in the game. These were proper cutscenes like done by like some animation studio. That's why these cutscenes, what's the nice way to say it? Looks so much better. Um, welcome to Forza Horizon 1, where it is such a vibe, my entire game is shaking. Wait, why is it just this camera view where it shakes? Like, this one's just fine. Fun fact, FH1 was actually never designed to run at 60 FPS. And you can actually see that with the character. You might be wondering why they're going so fast. Like, their animation is almost, like, sped up. The animation of the characters in this game are actually tied to the frame read of the game they're gonna be moving lightning speed hank says just keep in mind i haven't tried to mess with it so it might die all right yolo i think we broke the game welcome back to forza horizon one where i play the most cursed version of the wait look at the wheels the characters are moving <laughs> pretty quick. All right, there we go. Now we're looking good again. Remember back in Forza Horizon 1 when they had actual like sponsors for the race and stuff? I wonder if we can actually spot some real world sponsors in our opening race. There might be one right there. G-Shock. Yes, there is. And Bose. Oh my God. And Meguiar's. That is so cool. I don't know if it's just me, but I love like the colors and the art style and just like not gonna lie, everything about this game. A not so cursed race. Thank you very much. I wonder what else we should try and break for this game. One of the things that we can mess with is like the actual quality of the game. 480p anybody? Think our game is going to look like a potato. I mean, it's a little bit lower quality, but it still looks really good. Twitch chat said it looks better than the other one in my opinion. That might be because this is what it looked like when you played it back in 2012. It's actually using way less GPU now. I think we're good. Let's just just try V-Sync off and see what happens. Uh, let's try 4K 60 FPS. 4K 60 is really, oh, uh, oh dear. Wait, can I take a photo like that? Wait, will it work in photo? Oh my God, it does. Oh my God. <laughs> I think we just found the thumbnail for the video. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at my dedicated GPU memory. We are maxed.
I think I should do a race like this. All right, Mustang versus Mustang. <laughs> Look at the car! Bro, the game's actually working. It's kind of working. At least now I no longer have an RGB car. It just looks like I've got some static. Basically, if you were watching this in 2012, you would think this is a normal YouTube video. It's literally getting better. My inputs for steering are definitely delayed and like my brakes as well. Oh, Twitch chat says it's because of the traffic. That's probably a good show. Oh, it's getting bad again. It's getting bad again. No, it's good again. Wait, I think it's when it like tries to render in the finish line. If we get closer, I think it'll go funny. Never mind. That's that theory gone. So are you ready to see one of the other broken things in this game? Guys, we have a new problem. Look at my tire tread. So we've got to go into race central and get our new wristband. The V-Sync is so bad right now. This is a one strike and you're out deal. Okay. Okay. I get it. No dangerous ass clown behavior. He said ass. That is ban worthy in Forza Horizon 5. Just saying. Oh, that's a stupid question. So I could have a Mitsubishi or a Subaru. I'm going to go for the Mitsubishi. Uh, mistakes might have been made. Uh, what? Oh my God, the Subaru is really broken. Ah, 60 seconds per frame. I'm turning the 4K off. This is now unplayable. What happened to my rims? Hey, newbie. Keep those pretty eyes open. You might learn something. Oh yeah, I totally forgot about the AI actually bullying me. Wait, does that guy have a shadow problem as well? He does. Look at the Subaru. He's got a big shadow problem under his car. What a way to spend a 10th birthday. Did somebody really just say FH1 engine greater than FH5 engine? As much as people do like to simp for FH1, that's just blatantly wrong. FH1 didn't even have tuning, I would like to remind you. This was an awesome game, but let's not forget that it was missing some pretty basic features. The shadows are sus. The shadows are- wait. Um... Let's just load the game up again. You can definitely tell where the game crashed. That's a barn. That's a barn. That's a barn. That is 100% a barn find. I know I can't unlock you yet, but I did want to say hi. I found another glitch. I told you there were more glitches in this game. I'm just gonna drive my favorite Mitsubishi Pixel. All right, attempt number two, the race didn't crash that time. I have the steel case, the steel book version. Forza Horizon 1 limited collector's edition all access ticket. If someone wants to try to yoink my codes for them, feel free. Aha! Shit, 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 shit. Uh, all right, welcome back to Forza Horizon 1, I guess. Bro, Forza Horizon 1 is an incredible game, and I love every single minute of it. I cannot believe it is turning 10 years old already.